but the siblings whose phone numbers that I knew by heart versus the siblings phone numbers I don't know by heart not because their numbers are easy decided to say that my mother who I was never really allowed to talk to much because of the phone system and how the jail sheriff played with it and didn't allow me access to it which was illegal and immoral literally would not allow my mom to pay $100 to get my vehicle out. And apparently those sheriff were talking to my alleged birth family without my consent about all the things that were happening for me, which wasn't their lawful right, because I had no plan to tell them at all. But the reality is that that sibling caused me the loss of my vehicle. So by the time that my vehicle was pulled out or could have been taken out of impound, the charges on the vehicle was so fucking high, there was no point in me trying to go into debt to try to borrow money that they would have never loaned because they wouldn't even loan me the $100. And that value of paying off that daily charge of that impound in Indianapolis was a value much higher than the vehicle is worth because my family was taken advantage of by the guy who repaired my car and he literally walked off with five grand and my car never worked the same again. 